Hello Scorpio and welcome to me Tarot Owl. Today we're going to be doing your weekly reading. And it's for February 28th through March 6th of 2022. Let's do one more shuffle and we'll begin. Okay. So let's see what's going on with you Scorpio. First of all we have the star. Page of Cups, and the Six of Wands, the Six of Wands, alright, Knight of Swords, Three of Wands, and the Knight of Cups, wow, all these Knights, good heavens. Hmm. All right, well, let's begin then. All right. So, this is a uh, saying. Mm -hmm. Here's a star. Here's, here's your star card. This is representing you at this very minute. It's showing that a lot of wishes, a lot of wishes and a lot of dreams, um, are starting to uh, manifest, starting to come forward uh, towards you, you know, to come true here. You have a lot of wishes and dreams and hopes that are coming true because you have this great big star here, this great big star here. And these little stars are making a horseshoe. You know, they make having like a horseshoe shape here, and it's all full of wishes, all full of wishes. You know, and you're taking. You know, your, your emotions, you're pretty stable right now. You know, you have emotions pouring into the water, and you have uh, emotions of purity and water, you know, flowing onto the ground. You're, you're, pouring, you're pouring into the emotions and into the physical, you know, into your earthly, you know, you're staying grounded, in other words. You're, you're being grounded in your wishes and your hopes and your dreams, and they're all, they're all going to be... Uh, manifesting, so just be very careful on exactly what you're wishing and hoping for. But then here, here you have the Page of Cups that was in a little bit in the distance, distant past here, or perhaps just a few days ago to a week ago or more, and uh, it's showing that you're you were you were starting to uh, you were starting to wish and hope because you have a little you have a little fish here in this cup. Again, cups are for love love and emotions. Um, you know, you stand, you know, this, this page here standing with his hand on his hip, you know, like, okay, fish, okay, I'm ready. Let's get the ball rolling here. You know, and little fish is popping out of the cup and, you know, just, uh, you know, there's a lot of emotions and a lot of wishes are being granted. A lot of wishes are being granted for you. And that exactly proves this right here with the star popping out. And then you're in the near future here, you have you have the beautiful six you have the beautiful six of wands here. Six of wands, look at that. Has that laurel wreath up there on his head and around that wand that he's holding. Wands are for passion and uh, they're fire, you know, they're they're fire. So there's a lot of passion, a lot of fire, a lot of fight. So whatever you manifested, you're gonna is your victory. You you go, it's going to be a victory. It's going to uh, come true as long as you keep the faith and do, you know. And uh, when you're manifesting or wishing and hoping, make sure that it's all pure. You know that there's no um, no negativity going out towards anyone or anybody. Because, uh, as you can see, there are people down here. There are people here. There are people down here. And uh, some of them, some of them have their staff, their wands straight up. Rah, rah, rah. And some have them kind of tilted. So it's just kind of coming through as a warning as well that, uh, you know, keep, you know, stay away from the negative. Keep your thoughts, keep your thoughts pure and positive. Because, you know, you want to... You want to go along with this this uh, love, this because this could be a love relationship, you know, happening right now. 
And you could have been wishing, you know, wishing someone would come forward to you and wishing, you know, it's, it is, if this is concerning a love for you, it is going to be, it's going to be pure because you have a lot of innocence here. You know, there's a naked person here. <laughs> you got to have a lot of, you got to have a lot of, uh, oh, what's it called? Uh, well, you have to believe in yourself. You know, you have to believe in yourself and not worry what others are thinking, you know, to, to walk around naked. <laughs> Let's just say. There's a lot of purity as well. She got all these horseshoes all with white stars. So, you know, keep your wishes and dreams pure. Keep your wishes and dreams pure. And the, the victory is going to come. Because, alright, so now down here you have, you have the Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords right now. Someone is, someone is, um, someone is very willing and very wanting to have a relationship with you because this night here is just rushing in rushing in rushing in and if you noticed he is let's see if I can if you notice how the, the horse is rushing into rushing into here where you first started wishing and manifesting you know you were you were thinking this horse here is, is rushing in and telling you that here I am here's here's your night here I am here's your here's Here's your love right here. I'm rushing in. So it's as though, you know, as the universe heard this. So now this person down here is just rushing. It's rushing in to make sh to make sure he's the one or she's the one that's going to, you know, do your wishes here. And here you can see in their recent past as well. Here they are. They're standing here looking out over the water, just looking out over the sea. And they're they're dreaming as well. You know, they're dreaming, they're manifesting as well, hoping to meet someone or have a relationship. And, uh, you know, they're standing here looking out over the sea, and there's ships in the water out here. There's little ships down here, out here in the water. And uh, so he's he's standing there, or she, what, you know, and is manifesting, saying, when will my ship come in? Am I ever going to meet the right person? Am I ever going to meet the right person? And then when you look at your recent past here, here you are standing on the beach with a fish, you know, with all the water, you know, here's, here's, here's the same water. He's standing here looking out into the ocean, into the golden sea, wishing and hoping if his ship's ever going to come in. And here you are on the shoreline of that same water where you, you have a golden cup, you have a golden cup and you caught a little fish and a uh, little fish is acting like a genie and he's going to uh, you know bring your wish bring your wish of love to you okay and then at the then in the near future for the significant other he's also on a horse he's on a horse he's a he's a knight you're both on your horse you're both on your horses this is the knight of cups The Knight of Cups, as you can see, is ready to take, you know, he has that, this big wonderful cup in his hand. The cup that you had your little wishes, the cup that you had your wishes in. He has it in his hand as well, riding on top of his, riding on top of his beautiful gray, gray horse here. And he's going to go, he's going to, making the horse, says, okay, let's get through this water, let's get over this water, let's go through this stream and climb up that mountain. Let's climb up that mountain. Horses, I mean, uh, horses are all, well, horses are all about travel, obviously. And you're both riding these beautiful, you know, these beautiful gray horses. Gray is for wisdom. Gray is for wisdom. It represents wisdom. And, um, oops, wrong way, wrong way. So, you know, he's, you know, he's, He's ready. He conquered. He did all the conquering. He manifested here on this gray horse, zooming, zooming to this wish. Wishes are all con all your wishes are going to be fulfilled. It's just going to be all fulfilled. Here's the the Knight of Cups with that great, like I said, holding that cup. He's sitting tall and proud. The horse is like, yeah, let's do it. You know, he has his head bowing down. Your horse here. Your horse here. He has his head. 
slightly tilted back, like being kind of shy, you know. This horse here is being a little shy. You know, here comes here comes the stallion in the night. Look at how proud they are. They're very proud. So if you're either going to be having a wonderful uh, relationship this week, or there is someone that you wished and you dreamed, and it's being manifested, and it's going to be coming. It's going to be coming together real soon. Um, if it's not by the end of this week, it will be like um, in a month or so, because the future cards don't exactly mean uh, it's going to be snap right away. It could take you know one to three months, but um, you know there is someone on the way that you've dreamt about, that you've manifested about. Because they there's someone that's done the same, and you are going to, you're going to meet, and when you do meet, you're going to know, you're going to know pretty darn fast that it is who you want it to be. Because you know this this night he's just storming in, he's storming in. It's going to come in fast to you, and you're both going to know it. You're both going to know it. Okay, so that's your reading, Scorpio, and you have a great day. Bye.